I'm Douglas Carswell, your local Member of Parliament. I'm standing here at Bishop's Park College, a brand new school that many of you will remember was built here in Clacton to serve the local community. It was meant to be a perfect school, a sustainable school, a school for the long term. Some of you will remember that the then Prime Minister, Tony Blair, came and opened it. Today the school is in danger of closing. The paint has barely had time to dry, but already this school's future is in doubt. So much for education, education, education. The reality for children here is cuts and closure. And here I am outside the Leeds School. The Leeds School in Clacton, many of you will remember, was a special school that looked after vulnerable children with special needs. Again, like Bishop's Park, it's been closed by this government. Its closure was found to be in line with the government's own policy of inclusion. A second school in Clacton to be shut by this government. And here I am outside Clacton Hospital. Just like Bishop's Park College and just like the Lee School, the story here at Clacton Hospital is of cutbacks. The Peter Brough Ward is an important part of Clacton Hospital. It's where lots of people with mental health issues, people who need looking after, get the treatment that they need. Yet we now know that the Peter Brough Ward here at Clacton Hospital is in danger of being shut. It's another illustration of how this government, despite all the promises, is not delivering for local services. I care passionately about our local community. We've seen public services that should be serving local people being cut back. We've seen the Lees School, Bishop's Park College, Peter Brough Ward, question marks over local public services, over hospitals and schools that were built to serve us. It's not right. We can and we should do much better. As your representative in the House of Commons, I'm demanding answers of the Minister. I'm putting the questions to the government departments because I believe we deserve better. Clacton deserves better.